Amidst the heated exchange between China and the United States or Taiwan, on the ground the situation is pretty tense as Chinese jets continue to hover near Taiwan. The Chinese troops continue to hold live fire drills in the South China Sea and also in the desert. Now, the footage shows the Navy firing from a warship, military vehicles and ground troops launching missiles and armed police in the Xinjiang Autonomous Region also taking part in these military drills. Now what is interesting, remember, is that the military drills are taking part are, are taking place not just in the Taiwan Strait but also on the other side of China in the Xinjiang province as well. The Chinese state broadcaster reported that the purpose of the drill in the South China Sea is to test the performance of weapons and equipment and also to improve the troops' ability to win. The tensions between China and Taiwan rose after the visit of the, to the self-ruled island by the U.S. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi. After which, China's military kicked off the naval and air force drills in areas near Taiwan from the 4th of August. And as Beijing continues with its military activities close to the Chinese-claimed island, Taiwan's defense ministry has reported that at least about 11 Chinese fighter jets crossed the Taiwanese Strait's median line and even entered into Taiwan's air defense identification zone. So the U.S. congressional delegation, interestingly, has arrived in Taiwan for a two-day visit, during which they'll be meeting with the Taiwanese President Tsai Ing-wen. According to a statement released by the U.S. Embassy in Taiwan, the meeting comes as part of a wider visit to the Indo-Pacific region. Now, the officials will discuss issues including the U.S.-Taiwan relations and also the global supply chains. Meanwhile, China and Thailand have kicked off a joint air force exercise, the first such drills in years, following a pause that was forced by the COVID-19 pandemic. Now, the Thai Air Chief Marshal said that the joint exercises named the Falcon Strike will go on till the 25th of August in the northeast of the country. And the Air Force drill is meant to strengthen relations and understanding with China. Last week, Beijing had said that the visiting Chinese contingent will include fighter jets, bombers and airborne early warning planes. Now, the Falcon Strike exercise comes after China's biggest ever military drills around Taiwan and Thailand is the oldest American ally in Asia, but ties have been complicated since the military coup that took place in 2014. Now, Thailand has sought to strengthen its relations with China and has made several defense procurements as well. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.